Introducing first, fighting out of the blue corner. This man is a mixed martial artist, only a professional record of 22 wins, one loss. He stands six feet four inches tall, weighing in at 185 pounds. Israel, the last style bender, Adesanya. And now introducing his opponent, fighting out of the red corner. This man is a kickboxer. Making his professional debut here tonight. He stands 5 feet 11 inches tall, weighing in at 155 pounds, fighting out of Bangkok, Thailand, Russia. Okay, protect yourself at all time, obey my command at all time. If you want to touch love, do it now, go back to your corner. So here we go with the start of this fight. I'm anxious, man. What a matchup it is, and it's going to be interesting. And it's going to be interesting to see who has the upper hand early. It's going to be difficult to find out how this plays out, right? Striker versus well-rounded fighter. Who's going to be the one that's going to control where this fight takes place? Oh, nice land there with the punch. You see, he's taking advantage of what is an obvious edge in reach. Well, perhaps a sign of things to come as he lands a kick there. Nice kick landed by this gentleman. Oh, nice punch there by Adesanya. Right hook attempt, that's a miss. Nice one, two there. Straight right hand, no good. All right, he'll engage in a single collar tie. DC didn't take him long to find his range here tonight, huh? His timing is on point. Big right hook coming, it's blocked. All right, so one minute into the fight, we've got a full-on brawl here, DC. It's great for the fans, not necessarily for the gas tank if this thing goes much longer. Not great for the gas tank and not good for the old noggin. You can't <laughs> take so many upside the head, somebody's going to sleep. Just misses there with the left. Oh, man, this is one thing you, you do not want to get kicked in the head in MMA. You cannot take too many of those head kicks, but this guy gets his leg up there so fast Sometimes you don't see it come. Oh, man. I think you jumped out of your seat a little bit after that kick. Oh, I did because I have time where I've been kicked like that. And I'm going to tell you one thing. It does not feel good. He's very tricky when he throws that body kick. Israel Adesanya gets caught with that punch. Just over three minutes to go. Caught that kick there. He has a commitment to kicking tonight, and it shows. So just over 20 total strikes have now landed for the last style bender, Israel Adesanya. Oh, beautiful strike there by Israel Adesanya. He's got a lifetime in the game, not a lifetime in the UFC, but you see, this is a lifelong striker who is very dangerous with all limbs. Yeah, and when you're standing with Izzy, you're in trouble, man. You're under constant attack the whole time because you never know what he's going to hit you with. And right there, he lands the strike that he was looking for. That jab is fast. Look at that jab. Oh, wow. Huge head kick. Good job keeping that. Just unable to quite find that range. Under two minutes to go. Look at how he turns his hip into that leg kick. Nice strike. Throws a big right hand, but doesn't find its home. Nice shot to the body there. Got the single collar tie. Look at how he drives his knee right into his opponent's midsection. Oh, and he caught the kick. Head kick lands. Oh, really using his reach advantage as he landed the jab there. 
Way to hide that leg kick. Big punch lands over the top. How's he gonna follow this one? Ooh, head kick lands, he's hurt. He ate that kick. He took that whole kick, yep. Oh, big left. Oh, the kickboxing chops on full display with that offering. Nicely done. Beautiful kick landed Whoa. by this man. Oh! Oh, nice high kick. Oh, nice right Back here. and forth we go here. Oh, straight right. Oh, he lands another strike to the body, really starting to connect on a lot of shots to the midsection. And these will take their toll as this fight goes into the latter rounds. Massive head kick. Final seconds of round one. Oh, straight right. Round two coming up next. All right, so a huge round for him there. His opponent will need Motrin tomorrow. Huh. A lot of head kicks in that previous five minutes. He took way too many head kicks. He was trying to go forward. He was trying to pressure. And when he was doing that, he was carrying his hands low. And his opponent was just wrapping that kick up and over the side of his guard. Credit to his opponent for finding this shot, but really bad on him for not really making the adjustment to stop it. All right, DC, buckle up. Here we go with our next round. High number of kicks landed in the previous round, and he'll look to keep it going here. He'll look to keep winning the fight with his kicks. He's throwing high kick, leg kick, body kick. He's even throwing a couple spin kicks in there. This guy is so educated with fighting with his legs. So he's really starting to put together some significant body shots here. These are going to take their toll as this fight goes on. Able to check the high kick. Again, he's looking for that left. It's not there. Oh, and there's a land with the kick. So certainly a good sign for him there. When that's working, you know he's in for a good night. Look at him drive his shin into his opponent's body with that body kick. So he lands a double jab there. He continues to work off of that weapon, and you felt like that was a big key for him coming in tonight. Very important for him to start popping that jab. He's doing it over and over again, and he's finding a ton of success. Adesanya's kick, that one blocked. Big powerful punch lands. Now he gets back to range. Nice counter left hook to the head. All right, so he's landed some good shots tonight, but this is not a combo meal, right? No three-piece, oh. no soda. It's one and done more often than not. John, don't you come to me without a combo. I want the <laughs> whole platter. Give him the whole platter, young man. Put some punches together. Make this guy take the whole thing. Give him more than one strike. You have now found a set of punch. The jab is landing consistently. Find something that's going to go behind it. And they separate. Great upper body movement defensively. Slips another strike there, and... Offensively, he hasn't been a world beater, but defensively, he's been strong tonight. And that has to cause frustration for the opponent. Not being able to hit a guy that you want to really put away. But that's a testament to the head movement and the activity and the awareness of this fighter defensively. Yes, they heard him in the last round. Same exact one. Big kick land. Over and over, he's landed these big body kicks. Blocks the shot. Great punch landed with so much power. Nice body kick right up the elbow. And both guys really throwing with authority. Oh, lands a left punch there, and a lot of it's set up by good footwork. Really great footwork and setting traps so that he can land that beautiful left hand. Oh, he landed a beautiful straight punch there, DC. He's got an edge in reach, and... Whoa! Dude's hurt. Serve him up. Go get him.
just misses with the straight left hand. Adesanya's lower jaw now starting to show signs of swelling. Well, a really good second round for him thus far. After a somewhat lackluster first round, he has found the rhythm and found his striking range. Scary proposition for the opponent now here in round two. Ooh, big shot land. I mean, he's cutting him down to size with these beautiful leg kicks. Look at him whip his hip into that kick. So the taller fighter lands a huge flying knee there. Beautiful head kick. Wow! He's in trouble. He's hurt bad. Oh! Both guys landing with conviction now. Oh, that's a nice strike. Knee to the body. You don't know when that leg kick's coming. Throws the right hand there. Look at how he turns his hip over when he throws that kick. 20 seconds left. Oh, landing a punch with the left hand now, so certainly putting it all together on the feet tonight. He's doing a lot of work with his offhand. He's throwing every part of himself into these big leg kicks. Two Go rounds on. in the books. All right, so a big knockdown for him, courtesy of that punch in that round. DC, here's a replay. Big moment in the previous round. They were both fighting very well, but when he landed this punch right here that sits his opponent down, it showed that the power is not equal, and if he can land, he does have the ability to damage it. You ready? You ready? Fight! Punches in bunches, and he hasn't really shown any signs of slowing down here tonight. Connects with a punch there, DC. You like this guy. I like this guy a ton. And to watch his punchline just puts a smile on my face. You wonder if the offensive fighter is going to start to get frustrated here. Most stiffed on all these shots are getting blocked. They're getting blocked because he's fighting one of the best defensive fighters in the UFC. Superman punch. Oh, big knee! What a fantastic strike to throw at the exact right moment. He deserves this moment. Go finish this fight. Unable to connect there. Adesanya's got a bruise now starting to appear on the right side of his body. Oh, straight right. Oh, and he connects there. His hands look good tonight. So fast. I mean, this guy has tremendous hand speed. He does everything so well. And he's so calm. He's so calm in the face of such a big spot. Oh, and he lands another knee there, DC. It doesn't always pay to be the taller fighter. In this instance, it most certainly did. Look at him chopping the wood. Chop the wood with those leg kicks. Okay, okay, let's focus. Let's focus. Right hand on point. Nice straight punch. Well, he walked into his opponent's range there and... Whoa! Oh, he's hurt bad. He's hurt bad, John. He's got to press him. He's got to go chase that finish Whoa. down. Just over three minutes to go in round three. Three minutes to go. Oh, straight right. Wow. Just misses with the straight right. Oh, he's landed a high number of total strikes here in the latter stages of this fight. He's really picked up the pace and landing far more strikes than he did in previous rounds. Single collar tie now. Straight punch lands. Oh, 
Nice counter shot there. Trying to establish that jab once again. He is throwing a fast, straight, hard jab. That's not a feeler jab. That's one that's really knocking the head back. Just out of range with that kick attempt. Oh! He needs to start looking to finish now because he's got his opponent hurt very bad. Good fight here, under two to go. Working off of his back here. Looks like he may try to hip escape. Strong bottom work here, staying busy. Oh, man. This ground and pound is good. Probably my favorite striking realm in MMA, and he's as good as it gets. The problem is his opponent is not controlling his posture. He's allowing his opponent to get up, and when he does, he creates this space to land these beautiful ground and pound combinations. Israel Adesanya, ground and pound from half guard now. Oh, really nice work to keep busy off of his back as he lands some more offense here for Bob. And he's looking for that left hand, just missed. Man, look at Adesanya putting his words into action. I don't throw and hope, I aim and fire. The accuracy is just on a completely different level, and not surprising that he has drawn comparisons to the consensus greatest middleweight champion in UFC history, the great Anderson the Spider Silva. Wow. Oh, and he continues to pour it on. We mentioned earlier the aggression with his striking. Got to be careful to not gas out here, but at least you have to admire the approach. Outstanding knee to the body there. He's the taller fighter. Might as well put that size to good use, and he certainly did so there. Adesanya's lower jaw is extremely swollen now. Just out of range with that right hook. That one snuck in. Nice strike. Oh, ten. Oh! Who's hurt? Serve him up. Go get him. Seconds winding down in round three. Well, you gotta stay busy. What a round. Hey, stop! All right, let's check out some of the action DC, and how about the punching acumen by that fighter in that previous round? He does not waste anything. He does not loop punches. Everything's tight. Everything's precise. He's a sniper. We always talk about how he's a sniper. He is a sniper, and it showed in that exchange that allowed him to drop his opponent. Okay, okay. You've been knocked down before. When you come up, when you come back, you won, okay? You can do this. Stay on the outside. You ready? You ready? Fight! Flips to avoid the right. Right under the elbow, the body keep laying. He's in trouble. Nice kick. Well, he's up, but oh, is he hurt. He's able to slip the left there. Well, that body kick was there earlier, not there on that attempt. Whoa! Nice job by the fighter here to continue to block the shots coming his way. You think he's trying to sort of fatigue his opponent here a little bit? He's kind of watching and seeing everything that's happening. Oh! up a knockout, but this was really a striking clinic from the moment they touched him. I mean, a competitive fight that one guy finally found the shot that ended the fight, but both of these warriors displayed a ton of heart. One guy got the finish, but neither guy should be disappointed in their performance. The official decision